So, um, yeah, I think this is a super cool interaction. That's why I pulled my camera. Out. I saw that. Yeah. <laughs> it was a great scene. I'm with you on that moment. <laughs> but, um, what, would you be open to me just talking to you on camera? Yeah, I yeah. mean, it, is, it, is it a now moment or is it like you, okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Um, but just but just talk to me about coming out to San Francisco from New York. Okay. Or if there's something else that you want to say, I don't want to. You know what I mean? All right. No, I'll talk to you about that. Let me get, let me let me like work the story in my head. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, so I came to San Francisco um, after spending a month in Spain where I went running with the bulls. Awesome. Uh, I did not intend to go to Spain. I had spent a year of my life after a, a horrible business with a partner of building a farm in New York. And um, that went just completely bankrupt. And uh, after six months, I moved back home and I just saved up money to go on his travel. Mm. Um, and I wanted to cross the country. Got in a car accident and I had to put all my money into the car to repair it. So. I saved a little money I can, and I went to Spain. And then when I came back, I just found a girlfriend, and she's like, "Well, I'm going to San Francisco." And I was like, well, "Fuck it, so am I." <laughs> so I came over here to the Bay Area, and I didn't have, uh, I, you know, after Craig, it was like October, and after Craigslisting for about three weeks straight, I thought I had something, right? And then I realized people around here are much different from New York, where it's like, in New York, we're assholes, we're known to be assholes, but if we like you, we like you, and it's like if a deal is a deal. So. The last day where I'm signing a contract and going to this woman's house, uh, she just never picks up the phone. And I have this 50 pound bag over in Daly City uh, and I'm just all alone. I was alone. So I had to, um, for like a couple hours, I'm sitting in the barge station depressed, wondering if I'm going back home or not. And I, uh, I looked up Airbnb. And on Airbnb, I found this awesome spot in Millbury with a bunch of like entrepreneurs and people, and that's where I've been at for four months now, and I'm real happy about it. It's like kind of the way the adventure has gone. Okay, mm. so, yeah. Yeah. You, you definitely seem like a um, go flow kind of guy. I, I'm just I'm just curious, has it always has it always been like that for you? Was there like a point in your life where maybe you wouldn't have been, you know, spontaneously just go like go to Spain and go out to San Francisco and everything like uh, that? No, none of it is spontaneous actually. It always comes with a huge amount of like, me versus myself in my mind, right? It's like, it all started, I went to uh, a, f a festival called it's all good. We, we... Rainbow, Rainbow Gathering. I don't know if you've heard of it before, but it was uh, some really, really open-minded people that I enjoyed being around told me I needed to go with it. And they said, well, the next one is on December 21st, 2012, which was like a big oh, moment yeah, 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 in history. So big, yeah. And it was like a month. Um, it was like the end of October when I heard about it. So. It's like this big moment where it's where I'm fighting myself and I'm like, all right, am I a believer of my values, right? If an opportunity comes, I have to jump on it or not. So um, it's really like I'm confronted with these things and I have to jump on it. Otherwise, I know I miss out on a huge experience. I don't want to. Beautiful. Yeah, so it's never like just like, oh, you know, like, oh, that's cool. It's always like, fuck, all right, am I going to do this or not? Yeah. <laughs> And I just, uh, I hope I make the right choice by, you know, I think in the future, like, when I'm a 40-year-old man, you know, and I have children or grandchildren, and I want them to know, like, my life was really full of diversity yeah. and experiences, and they should have the same, yeah. you know what I mean, rather than being stuck in the same place and hating life. Uh, okay, man. Is there anything else that you want to say? Uh, this is really interesting. How the hell this happened? <laughs> <laughs> just, just wanted to stop by and say what's up. <laughs> and um, do you guys know a place to eat? Oh hell yeah! What, what, you, what kind of food are you looking for? Oh, I'm open, dude. Well, I mean, the mission's famous for Mexican food. Yeah. The